I'm sure yeah. nobody was more concerned about uh, uh, Connor Murphy's health status than mm -hmm. you uh, on Saturday. Have you been able to keep in touch uh, with the Blackhawks or him in particular to see how he's doing? Uh, yeah, obviously felt pretty bad. You know, you don't you don't want to see anyone go out on a stretcher, and you know I. Got a got his number from a buddy, and uh, I reached out to him, and um, you know I'll let the Blackhawks kind of let you guys know how how he's doing. But uh, you know he felt um, that I ex or he accepted my apologies, so um, I'll just kind of leave it at that. You just have to park that now and move on with the next game and the next shift. Basically, is that the approach? Yeah, I mean um, it's obviously something you think about. I mean. Try to stay off social media, and I mean it's kind of always there. But um, yeah, it's something that I got to put in the back of my mind. And you know, at the end of the day, I I got to keep playing the same way. And you know, things like that are going to happen. Obviously, that was an unfortunate case, but um, you know, I just got to play hard and uh, play within the rules. Your team have this game marked in the calendar based on the last result in Arizona uh, last week. Yeah, we just got to come out and, you know, play a good 200 foot game. And, um, you know, I think if uh, we get back to our identity, I think uh, we'll have a, a good chance tonight. Parker, with, the, with, with your style of play, how important is it that respect? Um, you know, when you're throwing a lot of body checks and I mean, DJ spoke to us about seeing you uh, in the intermission and saying that you were really down. Is, is that um, a big part of, of your game? It has to be respect for the other team. and. Um, yeah, I mean, um, it's obviously, it's tough. You know, I'm a guy who plays on the edge and there's, if I'm going to be honest, there's going to be times where I'm going to go over and, um, you know, it's just about balancing that. But obviously playing within the rules is, you know, something I've always done my whole career and, you know, I wouldn't consider myself, you know, a dirty player. I mean, haven't had a suspension in the American League. I think I only had a couple in the Western League. So I've never been a guy who, you know, is taking liberties, I'd say. So playing within the rules is something I've kind of always done. It's more just I, I play hard and, and on the edge. Parker, with uh, five goals this year, you had a couple of against Arizona. Just how comfortable are you feeling on the offensive uh, side of things right now here in the NHL? Yeah, I think obviously that's that's a bonus. And, you know, pucks are going in for me right now. But at the end of the day, I just want to be, you know, a good fourth liner and, you know, getting pucks in and creating momentum for the other lines. And, you know, I think my line's done a pretty good job of that. And, you know, Wadi and uh, Gamble, they've been great to me. And, you know, kind of taking me under their wings and showing me how it's done. And, uh, you know, I can't thank those two guys enough. Say, how much of an influence has obviously Austin Watson been on you so far? Yeah, I think, uh, you know, he's been great to me right from, you know, where he got it when he first got into the organization. Um, he's been a guy who's always came up and talked to me. And, you know, we've always talked about, you know, how to play the right way. And, you know, he comes up to me and tells us what the game plan is tonight and what we need to do to, you know, be successful and you know he's someone who you know I kind of look up to and obviously he's been in the league a long time and someone who I respect greatly. Did teammates talk to you about what happened and just say you know this stuff happens? Yeah obviously you know Brady, DJ, um, you know a lot of the guys who weren't playing obviously first came up to me and um, yeah everyone's been pretty good just telling me you know it's a hockey play and uh, stuff happens and yeah just pretty thankful for all the the support. Relief not to hear from the league or to supplement the discipline? I mean, yeah, it's it is what it is. You know, if if I was to get suspended, I, I would have took full responsibility and you know served my suspension. So um, I mean, to not get suspended, I mean, it is what it is. But uh, yeah, just gonna go about it one day at a time. DJ Smith said, uh, I think a little bit after uh, the camp that uh, we're basically at the NHL level. A few weeks ago, he said that uh, you were forcing him to give you more ice time. How easier was it for you to actually play your game knowing that you're backed by your coach? Yeah. Um, obviously, excuse me, um, when your coach likes you and, um, you know, I'm trying to build trust with him, obviously, and to know that he likes my style of game, obviously, it gives me, you know, trust in myself that all I have to do is go out and play my game. And, uh, you know, DJ's been great to me. He's given me a lot of opportunity, and, you know, so has all the other coaches. So, I'm just trying to take that one day at a time. You know, I'm still young. Um, I mean, just trying to come in, be a sponge every day. And, you know, obviously I'm going to make mistakes and stuff's going to happen. But, you know, at the end of the day, if I'm just playing my game and thankfully DJ likes my game, that, uh, you know, I can stay here as long as I can. Now that you know that you have the trust and the management and the coaches, what are the areas where you're trying to get better in order to grow on your role and to get more ice time and more? 
Um, yeah, I think, you know, personally, I'd like to see myself get a little bit better at uh, puck protection. I think that's something that, you know, can help me both in the D zone and in the offensive zone and, um, you know, wall battles too. That's something I've kind of, I wouldn't say we struggled with, but I think I can win a little bit more. And, um, you know, penalty killing is also, also one thing that, you know, I think I've been good at at other levels and something I'd like to expand my role on. But, you know, when that time comes, I'll be ready. But as of right now, I'm just, you know, playing my minutes and, you know, just trying to, to stay here.